If you wanna just get to what this video is about, then you can just go ahead and skip to this time in the video. It'll also be in the chapters in, in the timeline if you wanna scrub through the video itself. But I'm on the way to uh, hang out with my friend Brock, Nemo, Christian, and Zeke. You already met Brock and Nemo a while back, um, but they're kind of just playing games for the day. We're heading out to Brock's house. He lives out in the country right now. And so I'm actually going to explain this tutorial while I'm there, and I'll tell you an easy way to make masking a quicker process in Premiere Pro. Every time I come here, I never know which door to go through. Cause there's like the back door and the front door, but it's on the same side. Back door? Front door. Buddy. What is up, people? Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> they're playing Call of Duty. And it must be intense cause they're standing up. I think they're doing zombies. Um, I'm not exactly sure if you can hear me right now because the TV's so loud. But, uh, you know, it brings back memories from when I used to play back in the day. Oh, was it? What does a good burger consist of? Great sauce, great sauce. The high meat quality and the meat getting cooked right. I mean, if you like have a poorly cooked burger, that's obviously wet. Right? You got the onion? Oh, yes, sir. No, you, you, went, you went crazy with the onion. Oh, what do you put onion? Huh? You gonna put anything else on it? Nah, that's it. That's it? No ketchup? No. Oh, no, I got the you special got the, sauce. I mean, you got the sauce, on. but you know. Yeah. Dang, I always do this. <laughs> yeah. Bro, it's the bottom <laughs> one. <ball. laughs> <laughs> the bottom <laughs> Gotta find one. I think I found it. Yeah. Oh. He's speechless. Oh, yes, sir. He's speechless. Yes, yeah, sir. Man, I, I wish y'all could eat this, bro. That's too bad. So, if you decided to click ahead and just join me right here, hey, my name is Relly. I'm a video creator, content creator all that kind of stuff. And the main tip I just want to teach you about or just make you aware about is when you're using the mask or creating mask in Adobe Premiere Pro. Typically people say not to use Premiere Pro for masking because in After Effects it's a lot quicker, it's a lot smoother. But just in case you don't know how to use After Effects or Premiere Pro is all, all that you have, here's a quick way you can just make it a little bit quicker. So if you have a mask, you drew your shape, whatever it is, and you need to animate that mask, you would first click the stopwatch near the mask path option and then scroll ahead a little bit into whatever you need to mask. So if you're masking out something specifically, then you would readjust the mask and it would make a new keyframe and sometimes it would take forever to do. This tip doesn't necessarily make the process a lot faster, but it's faster in my opinion, if that makes sense. And all you have to do is in the opacity, under the opacity where you see the FX, the effects, you just click that once and now there will be a line slash through it. And once there's a line slash through it, that means that it won't show and you'll see that in your preview monitor. And because it's not having to necessarily adjust the mask every single time, but you can still see the outline of the mask, in my opinion, it's a lot quicker. Um, it still gets the job done. Um, I've learned to adjust to doing this. I typically use After Effects to mask everything, but when I don't really feel like opening up After Effects or anything like that, this is the method that I use to just quickly mask something. And instead of like cutting out a shape and then slowly going out, I can see the entire picture and then make the adjustments that I need to make. Let me know if you have any questions. If that didn't make sense, feel free to comment down below, send me a message on any social media platform, or you can even send me an email if you want to. I'll say, go ahead and say thanks for watching this video, but in the meantime, I'm gonna get back to playing Call of Duty or Madden or whatever we decide to play. Oh, and by the way, just in case you were wondering, all of us have been together pretty much like since COVID stuff. So like we're taking precautions and everything like that. But yeah, I just, I just don't want you to think we're being stupid. We got an intense game of Madden going on. So we're about to get into their face and see what's really going on in their head. At least try to. How do you feel to be down by seven? 
You know what? Honestly, I thought it'd be worse. So I, I'm feeling pretty good about myself at the moment. How you feel to be winning? I mean, it all feels good to win. No, you, got, you haven't won yet. You're winning. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah there's a I'm difference. I'm just saying, in general, it feels good being in the league. <laughs> I'll throw a pick, bro. I won't. Throw a touchdown, baby. Yes, sir. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's all good. She can't stop my offense. I really all right, can't. historically, Christian has beat Brock pretty much every time because Christian is really good at Madden. So that's why this game is very important. And um, they, they, they tend to get into it a lot. I think the last time Brock lost by like 14, 21 points maybe. I'm sorry, I just got to do it. I, Man. I he, he's got two of them bombs that are just, in my opinion, he's complaining about the game not being realistic. That's unrealistic. For sure, do not question the arm strength of Patrick Mahomes. One of the so, like, if he wins, it'll be a big deal. I don't think Brock's ever beaten Christian before. So, it's kind of a big deal. Can we play on that end? Not the excuses. Do you see what he just did? Not the excuses. Oh, he just got sacked. Oh, no. So there's like a minute and a half left. <laughs> and Christian is down by eight points because Brock went for two and got it somehow. So I think he's, he's, he's getting a little, little stressed out a little bit. <laughs> uh, oh, wait. Oh, it's, oh, it's over. GG. GG. I'm sorry, Christian. I'm, I'm sorry, man. And that's the game. Yeah, yeah, we're about to get some ice cream, man. I'll cheer you up. Yeah, yeah, we got some ice cream. We, we, got, some, we, got, some, uh, we got some ice cream in the fridge. Just in case you want to eat away what just happened. I'm Christian, I'm so sorry. I, I felt hey, for you. Let, can I say something? To make, to make my man feel better, in my defense, that's the first time I've ever beat him. Oh, we, played, we played like four other times and he's killed me every other time. So this was, he's not bad. This was just, I've gotten better. All right, I'll see y'all later. Later, dog. I'll see you Christian, Christian, good luck. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry that you're already losing, but. <laughs> hey, you can't say my dad. <laughs> At least he's only about one school. But seriously, I hope you win. See you. And then y'all play a third game. Oh, All right, bye.